hello guys welcome back to my channel if you are seeing my face for the first time my name is etty and today we are going to be talking about the five things you are doing that is making your acne or breakout worse acne can be very difficult to treat and sometimes so many people get frustrated while trying to treat acne and that is because as you are trying to treat acne you are probably doing some things wrong that is making your acne to be worse and it's not going away at all so in today we are going to be addressing some of those things that you need to start doing right in order for your acne to go away if you are stopping by for the first time please don't forget to like this video give it a thumbs up if you like it click on the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so that you get more videos like this from me and also don't forget to share these videos with your friends then let's get right into the video the number one thing on my list is that you are using your hair products too close to your hairline this one actually happened to me because my hair product used to transfer to my hairline and it always make me break out around my hairlines and then sometimes your hair product transfers to your pillow when you sleep at night it transfers to the pillow and then from the pillow to your face this clogs your pores and make you break out so what you have to do is that to make sure you use your hair product away from your hair lines and also try to protect your hair before going to bed cover your hair properly and use silk pillowcases when going to bed in order to avoid the transfer of your hair product to your face and also to avoid rubbing your face on the pillows you need to be careful in order not to transfer your hair product to your face either by touching your hair and then using that same hand you used to touch your hair on your face that is also wrong because there is a transfer going through when you, you touch your hair and then you also use the hand to touch your face this can clog your pores and make you break out even more even when you are using acne treatment products the second thing is that you are washing your face too much many people with acne think their face is dirty and this dirt causes acne and in order to get rid of the dirt they need to wash their face every now and then or wash their face like three to four times in a day this is not correct washing your face too much is only going to strip your face of the necessary oils that your face needs and once your face is stripped of its oil its natural oil it sends signal that your skin is dehydrated your skin is dry and it will make your skin to produce more oil the more oil it produces the more your acne will continue getting worse so don't wash your face more than two times a day no matter how dirty you think your face may be wash your face twice a day morning and evening to avoid overwashing your face and drying out your face unnecessarily so if you are using your body product on your face then you really need to stop it right now and get product meant for face because the face is more delicate and then it needs products that are made specially for delicate skins like the face so stop using your body product on your face because you are making your face prone to more breakout by doing that then another thing i like to do personally is that i do my facial routine before my body routine that is to ensure that i don't transfer my body product to my face if i rub my lotion and oil first and I'm, i will likely transfer it to my face so I tend to work on my face first before going to the rest of my body but if you are the type that likes to apply product on your body first before going to your face then you after applying the product on your body you need to go wash your hands properly to make sure you get rid of all the body products and then you can start with your facial products the next mistake you are probably making is that you are not using a moisturizer on your face this is a problem with most people with acne or oily skin acne prone skin since their face tends to produce excess oil they tend to stay away from moisturizers because they feel that moisturizers is going to introduce more oil to their face and they don't need that they just need their skin to dry up completely trust me you don't want to skip your moisturizer once your face is dry like i said earlier it is going to send signal that you that will make your skin to start producing 
more and more oil so the more you run away from moisturizers the more your face produces oils so in order to make up for the lost moisture on the surface of your skin on your skin so you need to always moisturize your skin and then you should also know the type of moisturizer you use don't use moisturizers that contains comedogenic ingredients like coconut oil because it tends to clog the pores oils like hemp seed oil rosehip oil grapeseed oil this oil doesn't clog the pores so you can use moisturizers like that on your face in order to help moisturize your face and prevent your skin from producing excess oil so moisturizer is very important if you have acne prone skin in order for your skin to stay supple and avoid excessive production of oil the next mistake which most of you make and most of you are probably guilty of this particular one is that you quit too soon you go in buy an acne product and after a few days after a few days to one week or two weeks you don't see results and you're like okay then this product is not working i'm quitting no you don't have to quit acne product is not a magical product it is not an overnight product that you apply today and in the next day you are already seeing great changes no it doesn't work that way so you have to maintain and keep using your acne treatment product for about four to six weeks before you can notice results and also i want you to note that it takes three to four months for your face to clear up completely so this is not something that is going to happen okay maybe two weeks treatment and everything will be gone no it's it doesn't work like that so you have to be consistent and use your product consistently for a long time to get that result also there are some ingredients that cause skin purging guys ingredient like salicylic acid benzoyl peroxide this ingredient tends to cause skin purging which means that it, it makes your skin to heal itself at a faster rate making all the underlying acne to come to the surface this makes you break out even more so many people when they when this happens to them they tend to discontinue using the product because they think the, they are reacting to the product and the product is not working and they just stop you shouldn't stop because when this happens it means your skin is purging and it's renewing itself faster healing itself faster than normal that is why it brings out all the acne from within to the surface of the skin so you have to continue using your product until four to six weeks and then you are going to notice results you start noticing results after then and then you also have to continue like i said earlier it takes about three to four months for you to get that perfect result so you shouldn't quit too soon when you start using acne treatment product because you really need to give your acne time to heal you don't have to be in a hurry and you have to stop jumping from one product to the other seeking for the fastest solution to your acne just stay consistent stay consistent on the product you are using and also try to research on your ingredients so that you know what is happening to your face an extra tip i'll give to you that most of you already know is don't go to bed with your makeup no matter how tired you were whether you went for a party you came back feeling so tired you couldn't do anything you couldn't even move a finger always try to wash your makeup off and you need to wash your makeup off completely completely use a toner to get deeper into your skin and clean off the excess of the makeup that your cleanser couldn't clean and make sure not to use a toner that contains alcohol because this tends to dry out your skin even more and if your skin is dry it produces more oil so what you want to do is use a toner that is alcohol free in order for you to get to the makeup that your cleanser couldn't remove or all your makeup wipes this is going to help prevent any breakout on your face thank you for watching this video till this point 
if you found it helpful don't forget to give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends also don't forget that i sell skincare products over at etifranskincare.com and also on instagram i'm going to leave a number on the screen which you can reach us i'm gonna be leaving the link in the description box where you can go to over to the website and shop for your skincare product on my website okay thank you for your support thank you for watching and i'll see you in my next awesome video bye